little bit, but uh, could be a football. rain out. Oh, goodness gracious. We have a lot of rain in the forecast for us as we extend into Sunday. Do you have any weekend plans this weekend? Uh, you know, Outdoors? they're they're in flux. They're okay. in flux. I mean, if you probably need to reschedule some things if they're on Sunday and if they're outdoor events. We have a lot of rain in the forecast for us heading into the next couple days. Let's get straight into it right now, though. Heading into this weekend's forecast, it's going to be split in half directly. Saturday is still a breezy, cool day for us. Temperatures remaining below average. We're seeing partly cloudy conditions, kind of like what we're dealing with this morning. Daytime highs today are still sitting below average close to the coastline. 60s there, 80s up in our East Inland Hills. But once we extend into this weekend, boy, are you in for a treat, especially your lawns. I'm sure a lot of us are going to be needing this as we head into Sunday and even on Monday. Our rain chances are increasing as an area of low pressure dives its way in from the north. This is a system pushing in from the Gulf of Alaska, so it's cool. It's a lot of instability in its system and to add to that it is going to bring us in some much needed rain about a quarter to a half inch just in those east inland hills about an inch along the coastline and even into the bay so as we take a look at water vapor extending into this weekend notice how it just streamlines its way directly into our coastline this system picked a trajectory and it is san francisco in a nutshell take a look at this heading all the way into saturday and even into sunday it really starts working in a counterclockwise direction the front leading edge of it, that basically means that we're going to be seeing winds push in from the south. It'll be a gusty setup for us Saturday and by Sunday, even into Monday, that's when it makes its debut. It looks like Monday we're going to see some some lightning activity with this system, though. Because of how unstable the system is out in the atmosphere, we're expecting that on Monday. But even as we head into Tuesday and Wednesday, we'll see it start tapering off, clearing up, and then we're left with daytime highs sitting right around average once again. We might even see some scattered showers off in the North Bay lingering as we head into Tuesday's forecast. We're going to keep a close eye on models and keep you updated here in the Weather Center. Jocelyn. All right, thanks, Jess. Let's take